What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Run Good coming at you with yet another video as we continue on with the secondary market series that we've been doing for 2020 Mosaic Football. Uh, this was a product that I was not able to find in my shelves. Found anything yet? Nothing yet, sir. How about you? Not a thing, sir. What about you guys? We ain't found sh I looked and I looked and I went to Target and Walmart so many and Fred Meyer so many times. Finally, uh, happened to get scooped at my local Walmart. Really, really frustrating. I'm tired of this, Grandpa. That's too damn bad! Um, I checked there so many times. I had a pretty good idea of when they were going to be restocked, but apparently somebody has been getting some insider information. Same person the last three weeks knows exactly when the stalker is going to show up. She's been showing up at random times on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Uh, that's also weird. Normally it's Friday for us. Um, just happens to know the customer service people say that, uh, he's followed her in once and another time showed up while she was eating lunch waiting. She's friendly with him. She does her thing. He empties it all into a cart. Uh, very, very depressing, uh, that that's happening in my small town. Not in my backyard. Um, but with that said, I have some good friends in the hobby. I have some good friends further south of me. I uh, found these at a Target and um, was able to split them with some other people. And uh, she sent me up four of these mega boxes to go along with the 20 blasters we're also doing in the series that I got from a friend in Philadelphia. Um, so I got uh, East and West Mosaic. And uh, we are going to do these two mega boxes. And uh, I do not think that it's going to get any better than our last video. If you missed the last video, you missed this hit. Uh, this is going to be a Got Games, Got Game fluorescent gold Patrick Mahomes to 20. Um, so I do not anticipate us seeing a better card than this. Now I looked at comps for this card. I saw that an orange fluorescent number to 25 had sold for 550. So between five and 600, probably a fair evaluation for this card. The product is quite new, so not too many of these have hit the market. None of the golds have hit the market. Um, so we will see if that's accurate or if it will go up or go down. Be interesting to see. But we have two more of these mega boxes on tap. You never know. Uh, maybe we'll continue to run hot. Maybe we'll hit something crazy. Maybe we'll see a Genesis or a rookie scripts gold or a rookie script. I don't think so, pal. I've not seen any rookies yet in terms of autographs. I'll go ahead and show you the back of a mega box so you can pause it to see what is all in these if you are considering making a secondary market purchase. Obviously, if you can find these on the shelves, you're going to want to buy them because this is the hottest product in football right now, uh, at least until Prism comes out. Prism already being pre-sold for over $900 a hobby box. Bro, come on! Which means that if you thought the, the hunt for Mosaic and you thought the hunt for basketball products at retail was bad, uh, just, it's going to get worse, guys. I'm, I'm sorry to say that, but it's going to get worse for Mosaic basketball and, or for Prism basketball and Prism football. Um, everybody knows Prism. Uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get underway. Here we go. Yeah, I, I was blown away when we hit that card. Could not believe it. We'll see. Uh, that one's going to be a very, very tough one to top. Probably one of the top 10 hits of the year for me so far. Getting a Pro Bowl Lamar Jackson and a Jerry Judy right off the bat. That is going to be an NFL debut. React Green. Also a Baker will win. But show off this Jerry Judy. Now I will say... I like that the Mega Boxes have a lot more value. You're going to get either 10 of these or the Fluorescent Golds take the place of these. Um, but I will say about this, man, whoever at Panini decided that green and red were good colors to put together, man, I don't know. It's in Christmas in October, but even this is pretty... This is one of the most ugly parallels I think they've done in a while. Boom. Roasted. They like to mix up colors in, like, choice products. You know, they do like black and gold and optic. They do green and, um, green and, what do they do? Green and red. But it's kind of that dragon look. Uh, I'm not a fan, not really too much of a fan of this particular color. But Jerry Judy, we will take it. We have a Van Jefferson. And, uh, let's stay hot on these reacts because we have a Drew Brees and uh, also a Flea Flicker insert. So a couple good reacts so far. But let's see what else we can find. 
Maybe we can find something else. It's going to be hard to top that. CD Lamb NFL debut. Also going to have a DJ Moore, Carolina Panthers, and a Dick Buttkiss as well. Buttkiss. It's always so weird saying his name. I feel like I'm saying it wrong, but I know I'm not. All right, we still have not seen a silver. We are going to get three silvers or silver mosaics per uh, mega box. So it, it seems like it seems like the hit odds. Wow, this pack is just all kinds of all kinds of bad. And uh, that's what I like to see right there. So is this going to be an AJ Dillon silver? It sure is. Let's just get right to it. KJ Hamler rookie, but um, J.K. Dobbins as well. Wow, what a pack! But the big one gonna be the A.J. Dillon silver debut. I kind of spoiled that. Our uh, our our parallels so far have been pretty good, save for that D.J. Moore. Five packs in. Those are some pretty good parallels. And uh, let's continue on. So a solid, solid mega box. It just seems like you're going to get more bang for your buck out of the mega boxes. Um, the blasters are fine, but we hit some autos, we hit some fluorescents. Um, you know, we've hit some nice stuff so far, but I feel like you get more rookie cards, you get more parallels, that's for sure. Uh, we have Robert Woods right there. And uh, Touchdown Masters Saquon, unfortunately, going to be out for the year. Um, but nice Touchdown Masters right there. So these are going to be $40 MSRP on the shelves. The blasters are going to be $20. You get 32 cards in a blaster, 40 cards in a mega box, but a whole lot more rookies and a whole lot more parallels. Pittman and uh, Herman Moore as well going to be the green. And we have an old school Ed Reed mosaic silver as well. would be nice to see a Genesis pop up or an auto. Uh, that, that big gold already. We saw one of those. Did not expect to see one of those. Nice Justin Herbert right here on the debut. Also going to be a Clark... Cal eh, Callis Campbell, excuse me, on the Pro Bowl. And a run CMC on the Touchdown Masters insert. Got another silver mosaic in here. So we've got Beasley, Justin Jefferson going to be the rookie. We've got Randall Cunningham going to be the uh, green for us. It's so hard, so easy to want to say red, but it's green. And we've got Jerry Rice, the legend, the goat. Jerry Rice on the silver mosaic. So many kid reporters. You got Daniel Jones, Brian Urlacher, Ed Reed, going to be the green. And a got game, Kyler Murray. He plays in the same division as my beloved Seahawks, and I, I assure you, he's got game. He's going to be a good one. Now he's got Hopkins down there. Scary combo, scary, scary combo. All right, couple, uh, one final pack, and we have a Justin Herbert true rookie. We'll take that. We have a Keyshawn Vaughn as well. And uh, we have, to go along with our Jerry Rice, we have a Steve Young. So let's go ahead and grab those two. They're going to look good together. A couple Hall of Famers. Steve Young to Jerry Rice. Taylor out to the left side. And Ricky Waters to the right. And a play fake. Young goes deep middle. He's got Jerry Rice. Touchdown, 49 You'd rather be hitting rookies, um, that's for sure. But, hey, a couple players that I respect. So not too bad. Overall, that Mega Box was solid. Nothing nothing crazy that, like, jumped off the page. Um, but nothing horrible either. Some decent cards. Let's take a look. Actually, let's just get into the second one, and we will do a recap at the end. But there was quite a few cards that I put in the hits column. Nice, like, five, you know, three to five dollar cards. Maybe a couple ten dollar cards. Let's see what else we can find. Got a silver prism. 
We've got Matthew Stafford green. Silver. I'm gonna be seeing a seeing a red chevron. Calvin Ridley. Calvin Ridley of the Atlanta Falcons. I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve those up. These silvers are super condition sensitive. Just all of that surface of for silver. Very easy to be scratched up. We've got McNabb, J.K. Dobbins, rookie. We've got Jalen Hurts, and that's going to be a true uh, React Green. Also, old school Ed Reed, a card I've already seen several times. But let's go ahead, hit this with a top loader for sure. I do like this quite a bit. Jalen Hurts, React Green. Moving right along. Do not want to see that fifth, fourth card in the pack. It is usually the hit, unless it's an insert. We got Jerry Judy. So we're hitting some solid rookies. Marshall Folk, green. And we have a... I think this is just going to be a mosaic will to win. Uh, going to be Josh Jacobs. Beautiful looking card. Really, really like that design. Josh Jacobs. The will to wins are good. The old schools, I don't necessarily think that they chose the best players for that set. But, I don't know. There's something about the old schools that just don't really resonate with me as this as much as some of the other, other insert sets. We have Cole Met, rookie. Julio, Julio, Julio Jones on the, or, the green. And a Larry Fitzgerald touchdown masters player I definitely respect. I watched him his whole career in the, the division with the Seahawks. Remember him and Bolden. Him and Bolden lining up together. That was a threat. Got Peyton Manning MVPs. TJ Watt Pro Bowl. And we got a silver prism. Looks like a saint. So maybe, I was going to say maybe Drew Brees, but how about a Cameron Jordan? So our silvers have not really, not really done the job at this particular mega box, but we will see if we can find maybe one good silver in here. Nice rookie. I do see a insert green on the back of this pack. We got Bosa, we got T Higgins. Zach Ertz going to be the green. And a Got Game Michael Thomas. Getting down there, just a few packs left. Hope you guys have been able to find Mosaic at your local store, unlike me. But if not, I hope uh, you, if you pick some up on the secondary market, I uh, hope you did well. We've got a Tua debut and a Kareem Hunt behind it. Let's go ahead and put this Tua in a top or in a penny. Uh, these are going for, the regular two is are going for about 20, so I believe this one's going for about 10 to 12. Debut Tua. And, uh, who else do we got? We got Kareem Hunt. And, uh, Tyler Boyd. I got fooled. I thought that was an insert, but, uh, unfortunately that is going to be the wrong Cincinnati bangle on that card. Looking for Mr. Burrow. He's not really shown up too much. Only one rookie card of him so far. So maybe he'll have a sighting a little bit later on in this uh, in in this uh, mega box. We got Rieger, rookie card. Antonio Gibson, rookie, react uh, green. And a got game, Lamar Jackson. All right, a couple packs left here. Still seeing. Uh, obviously, I don't think that we're going to get anywhere near... Uh, a Patrick Mahomes gold fluorescent to 20. Would be nice to see something like a Genesis or maybe an auto to end this mega box. Something decent in here. But let's just find out. Galladay, Palomalu, Marcus Mariota. And we have a will to win Dak Prescott. All right, we're down to one pack left. One pack left. Let's see if we can make it a good one. A little last pack magic. Maybe. Nope. Looks like an insert. So 
our React Green is going to have to be a good rookie if we want one final hit. Uh, how about that, though? Slot number two is going to produce a Tua true rookie. Our insert, let's just peel it off, going to be Keenan Allen. And uh, do we have a second rookie in this pack? We are not going to have, so we're going to have a Leonard Fournette, but we did hit one nice card out of our final pack. That is going to be the Tua base true rookie going for about 20 bucks or so, give or take. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the hits. Uh, some pretty decent hits. I did top load the Regor, or, or the Hertz, excuse me, Hertz, and that's going to be a green. Other greens, we hit the Gibson. We hit the Keyshawn Vaughn. Uh, J.K. Dobbins, Drew Brees, and Jerry Judy. Um, we hit a couple of Tua's. Do we hit yep two, one of each Tua? Our Silvers, Cam Johnson, Calvin Ridley, and uh, who else? A.J. Dillon debut, so that was probably our best silver. Maybe our best card. We have our, a couple of Herberts and a Saquon Barkley. So nothing amazing, but you know some decent stuff in there. Um, again, if I had purchased those at MSRP, eh, we probably made our money back or we made a little bit, uh, paying $125 per, which is, I've seen these go as high as like 160, 175, uh, average price seems to be about 150, uh, at 125, I don't think I made my money back on those two in particular. Um, but overall we are doing the series with 20 blasters, four mega boxes, and we're going to check and see uh, if we're able to make money at MSRP and at if we're able to make money at secondary market prices. I have a feeling that Patrick Mahomes is going to take a nice little chunk uh, out, of, out of the damage. Uh, that is going to do it. I have a financial recap coming up along the way. We may still have more blasters depending on how I want to upload this series. But that is going to do it. Take care. Stay safe. Hit that subscribe button. And we'll catch you on down the road.